Hello citizens, welcome to our new video. Today, thanks to someone, we have a 10 million USC to spend. So I woke up in my ship and I opened my Moby glass and this is what I found. Someone sent me 10 million USC. I want to thank you from the bottom of my heart. I don't know who you are, but thank you. I don't know if it was mistake uh, or someone said it deliberately, but here we are. So if you are watching this video, I'm thanking you one more time. So thanks to this, we have an opportunity to spend 10 million USC in a game now. And I am at the area 18 to look some of the nicest ships. So let's start with the Anvil Aerospace and see what we can buy here. So I have driven the Arrow a lot of times, very good ship, nimble, fast. I even pledged for it and then upgraded to Cutlass Black. Okay. Hornets. I don't really like Hornets. I don't like the, their look and their behavior and their weapons. For me personally, I think they are better ships, but who loves them? They are great ships. Let's go. Anvil Hurricane. One of the nicest ship in the game. Fast, nimble, strong. And if you have a co-pilot, it's one of the best ships in the game. Period. Since I am planning most of the time alone, I cannot buy this. Let's go. Valkyrie. So this is a mini hammerhead, if you want to say. If you have enough friends to fill all the stations, this is very rare ship in the game nobody buys him because for one player it's not so it, you cannot use its full potential so if you have friends this is a ship for you now this is the ship that I really want to have one day and this is a Carrack but sadly it's way over my budget so this ship will have to wait better times let's go Spartan, I don't really like this uh, ground vehicles, but they are very useful if you are doing some scenarios. Let's see, Hornets and Pisces Rescue. Now this is a very nice ship and I am very in temptation to buy one. So we will see about it. Let's see what we have here. We have a Nox. Nox is one of my favorite ships in the game and I'm going to buy it. There. I need a ship. Well, it's not a ship technically, it's a flying motorcycle, but whatever. And this is one of the funniest ship, well, the word funniest not work, it's one of the more agile and faster ship in the game the problem is if you get hit few times in the engines it becomes completely unuseful so we will have to skip it for now banu banu defender is a great ship great looking ship and the people often say it's very good for bounty hunter but i my experience with it was not so great I think there are a lot of better ships for this price. So we will skip for now. Mustangs, I don't like. Crusader. Crusader Su 2 Hercules Starlifter. This is a nice ship, but if I want to buy one, I would buy a variant that drops bombs. So this we cannot buy here. For this, we have to go to Crusader. Esperia. Now, these are ships that I haven't fly a lot. Esperia Prowler. Hmm. Well, this is the first ship that I will put on the list. And then we will decide at the end what we will buy. Esperia Blade. Fast ship, nimble ship, very good ship. Very good for PVA and PvP missions. I drive it a lot. Uh, I have a ton of experience with it. Only thing that I don't like is the viewing. Everything is red and the lights are even red and when you turn on the lights you see even less. So let's go. 
Xperia, Xperia, not Xperia, Xperia Talon. Well, these ships I haven't fly at all. So, and Shrike. Shrike is, I think, the version with the missile, and the other one is normal version. They are good ships, but the problem with them, they are too wide and there is a lot of moving parts that can be destroyed. So, let's go. Grey Cut Industry. These small cars are nice, but we will skip them. Kruger P-52 Merlin and Archimedes. Now, I never draw these little snub fighters, but these are combat snub fighter and this is a uh, competition racing. Maybe in the future I will get one to have together with my Mirai Fury. So, we will see. Razor. These are perfect for racing but and to have fun with them flying because they look amazing they look like a formula one look at this it's actually formula one without wheels but with the engines for space flight and we come and to origin origin we will skip all of this 600i touring this is a great looking ship. The only downside for this ship is it doesn't have a hangar. It has a beautiful staircase inside of the ship. So if you want to go and use the staircase, this is a ship for you. But we will not buy it now. Origin 890 Jump. Wow, this is amazing ship. Looks beautiful and one day I hope I'll drive it just for fun, but to buy it for something other than just flying around, well, I don't want to spend 32 millions that I don't have. <laughs> All right, what's this? Ah, this a razor. Okay, and there you go, 400i. 400i I already have. It's a beautiful ship. You can do a lot of with it. Also. You can do some PVA missions like VHRT missions. It's a little bit sluggish, but you get there. And where is our 600i exploration? So, what I am considering now is either to buy this Origin 600i ship and have fun with it and fly it with a style I already had one but I had a Turing before because before there was no precedent universe and I didn't want to fly with this hangar ship but now I'm seriously considering to get this 600i the second ship that I want the most is M2 Hercules Starlifter that ship looks not so great as an origin and it's not a luxury ship but that ship uh, it, it can earn you a lot of money if you are using it to transport the cargo which you can do extensively now in this 3.18.9.1 but this ship on the other hand is made for those who want to fly in style and also it has a lot of firepower it has three size 5 turrets and also it has a size 3 shields so which one will it be yes we also said the Xperia Prowler this is also a very nice ship I believe it has two size 5 and two size 4 hard points but I'm not sure completely but the look of it and the use of it for me it's a little bit off but the price is two times smaller hmm I think I'll go for the 600i where is it now? here it is luxury 
and I'll be left with 500,000 which I can use to build to buy some better quantum drive and better shields okay here we go whatever happens we have a 600 eye confirm purchase I have done it spent almost 10 million wow I have a Nox and 600 high now and also from before if you have watched my videos I have a 400 eye so let's jump now to the hangar to see this beauty of a ship 